Hey, how's it going? Parker Welbeck here with FullTimeFilmmaker.com. And in this video, I'm gonna be showing you my color correcting process using Lumetri Color inside Premiere Pro. Let's dive in. Step number one is gonna be to come up here to the color tab. We've been in the editing tab and I like to pull up my Lumetri scopes, which can be found right here. And again, this is C log footage on the Canon 1DX Mark III. And this will be my process for color correcting. Keep in mind, color correcting is different than grading. Grading is creating a specific look while correcting is just getting our exposure and colors correct to what the natural eye would see. So first thing with log footage I usually do is just bring that contrast all the way up and you see that expands our waveform and pushes our black closer to black and our whites closer to white. The goal over here though is gonna be to try and keep anything from touching 100 unless it's a blown out light, then obviously those are gonna be blown out and keep anything from touching zero, which is completely black. But I do wanna get as close as we can to those to utilize all the dynamic range that we shot with. So next I'm gonna pull my blacks down until we just about touch the bottom there and our whites are already touching the top now highlights and shadows kind of comes down to preference of how contrasty you want this image to look you want a little less contrast so we can bring up those shadows a bit and those highlights down a little bit here's the before and after so far now last thing i want to check are my whites these walls are white they were white in real life so they should be white here i'm going to get my selector here and just click on the white to give me a starting point so it brought down that temperature a little bit and the tint up a little bit it sometimes it doesn't select exactly exactly what you want and you just want to come in and manually put that right where you think is the best look for you if you want a little bit cooler or a little bit warmer so looking at our clip as a whole feeling pretty good about that color correction here's the before and after Probably the last thing is I might wanna throw in a little bit more saturation in there before and after on a little extra color. But that's pretty much it for color correction. That was what I saw with my eye. Next would be applying that same color correction to the rest of the clips and then shot matching to make sure that all the clips have the same exposure and colors throughout the whole video. So there you have my color correction process. Hopefully that was helpful. Thanks again for watching and make sure to check other Premiere Pro tutorials in this playlist. Link is in the description below.